What up? It's your boy, uh... It's your boy Nick, back with a very, very fun video. Back in March of this year, the official Mega Man Twitter announced that they would be holding a contest to celebrate the release of the Mega Man Zero ZX Legacy Collection. Now, at this time, I already had my copy of the game because Mega Man Zero is my boy. You may or may not have already guessed. I participated in the contest. How could I not? Zero is my boy! The contest seemed like a way to encourage fans to post and share more of their content relating to Mega Man and Mega Man Zero, which I thought was really neat. There were a lot of really incredible entries submitted to this contest, some of which I will show you. Every entry was so special and so fun to see because Mega Man Zero was one of the first games that I picked up as a youth. So it has a very special place in my heart. So naturally, I decided to enter the contest as well. Despite how old the costume was, I decided to submit pictures of my old Mega Man Zero cosplay uh, into the contest. I was chosen as one of the winners, which was... <laughs> Mind-boggling. So the official North America Capcom team reached out to me to deliver my prize. Unfortunately, COVID did delay the process of receiving it, however... It is now in my possession. So I figured it would only be fair to share the experience of unboxing this bad boy w with you guys. You want to see what's inside the box, right? You want to see what's inside all the boxes. So let's get boxing. Unboxing. The prize they gave out for this contest was this special edition, the Mega Man Zero ZX Legacy Collection. Now, this special edition was only released in Japan, so it is super special. I'm really excited to unbox it. It comes with this bust statue of Zero, the Japanese version of the game, as well as a couple other little trinkets that we're gonna dive into right now. First things first, you have the Japanese edition of the game. It's really, really cool as a collector to have this. I'm going to show you guys some comparisons of the North American version of the game and the Japanese version. So I was really, really excited to have this. Some might think it's silly to own two copies of the same game. Not I. So this part of the collector's edition, I believe was randomized. I think these were kind of like a gotcha type thing where the weapon that you would get is a keychain and the weapon that you would get was randomized. So I got the slave, but look at that bad boy. Really, really, really cool. It also came with this smaller box. Okay, we got some bubble wrap. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh! It's an acrylic stand! That's so cool. It's got the little stand piece on the back, so you can stand that up on your desk or wherever you want to keep it. That is cool! So that leaves just the statue. I'm so excited for this part. Even just the box is so cool. If eight-year-old me could see this, Ugh. okay. Ah! Ugh. I'm okay. Normally, I like to open my boxes from the bottom, but this one's got the fold down there, so we're gonna have to break the seal on the top. Unboxing ASMR. Okay. Okay. Oh, I'm so excited, bro. Smells good in here. Okay. Are you guys ready? Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> Oh my god, he's beautiful. Well, there you have it. That is easily one of the coolest statues I think I own. That's incredible. I love that it's got the motion of the hair going around the torso. Oh, that's so cool. Just to be able to say that I now own this special edition is a dream come true, and it would make my 10-year-old self crap his pants. So thank you so, so, so much to the Mega Man Twitter for hosting this contest. Thank you, Capcom US, for selecting me as one of the winners. I appreciate it so much. It is, seriously, uh, a dreamboat. This, this, this is awesome. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed the experience of 
unboxing this bad boy. I know I sure did. If you guys want to hang out with me more often, I do stream on Twitch Mondays, Tuesdays, Thursdays, Fridays at 5 p.m. Pacific time. So go ahead and follow me over there if you want to just hang out in real time. And I do plan on uploading some backlogged content, so look forward to that as well. Thanks you guys, as always, for sticking around for another goofy little video. I just think you guys are neat, so we'll see you next time. And if we don't, then just know I'll miss you. And that's a fact. Have a good night, guys. Bye! I don't know, man. I'd give it two thumbs. Way the heck up.